Hello everyone, great to have you with us. As you can see, we're at the Amex Stadium for this one. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Brighton up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Number two, Tarek Lamptey. Number 11, Leandro Trossard. Number eight. Is Basuma and number 10, Alexis McAllister. Good. Good and the team selected for Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, when you play in a 3 5 2 formation, the position of the wing backs is key. If they drop too deep, you can't dominate possession. And if they play too high, you leave the centre backs exposed. They have to get the balance right. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea starts in goal. Rafael Varane plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence. Scott McTominay plays with Fred in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Thank you for attending today's game at the Amex Stadium. Enjoy the match. Well, it might well be a game to save a Manchester United kick-off. <laughs> Pascal Gross. Bissouma. And he read it well defensively. Diogo Dallo. Cristiano Ronaldo. And return to Ronaldo. Well, tremendous block. Van Mata. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that. And it was close. Well, his skill level is so high. You're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Rossard. Now Caicedo. Options in the middle. Oh, surely! And foiled only by the crossbar. Splendid defending. And he takes on the shot. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Juan Mata. Not showing good defensive judgment. Oh, a lovely ball. And that's very good refer. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Who can he pick out? And you don't want to lose possession there. Sends it back. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Bruno Fernandes. A room to roam on the wing. Oh, he's through here. A mischievous effort. Oh, football finesse at its very best. You can't argue with that finish.
Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then just look at the finish, Derek. Just entices the keeper in, and it's a lovely little dink to deceive him. Fantastic goal and superb finish. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Well, he's beaten his man comprehensively. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. He has time to play it over. Well, not cleared away completely. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Can someone get on the end of this? And he clears the danger. Trossard pulls it back. Oh, great block. And a chance to level it. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. An important interception. Will they create? And fails to keep himself onside, unfortunately. Scott McTominay. Can John Scott, that's John Scott, please make your way to the ticket office. And Mata. McTominay. On to Bruno Fernandes. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Alexis McAllister has got the right idea with that pass touched onto the woodwork this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity he's in with a chance oh a goal how about that for a degree of difficulty simply off the charts Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. Well, a second goal for them here. Dunk. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, United have certainly controlled the ball, as you can see, and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield. Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. Oh, it's cheeky. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Who's going to get on the end of it? Struggling to get it away. Bruno Fernandes able to deal with the threat. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Massa. Went in strongly, decisively. A chance maybe from the wide position. And a decent delivery. Well, not cleared away completely. Danger averted for now. 
Counter-attacking very much an option. Individual brilliant, real chance. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason. He's bossing the game, Stuart, and giving the defenders headaches. Well, he's been at his best today. He just seems to get his shots away so easily, and he's taken his goals really well. Brilliant stuff from him. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And it's in! This game very much back on as a contest. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Fred. And take it away. Could be a chance to break here. Bisuma. And still danger here. Oh, he's done it. But hang on. Offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here. But the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. Substitution time it is here. Fred. And it's a quality pass. Pascal Gross. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Bisuma, and it might be. Oh, magnificent reaction. Ronaldo lost it. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. He's found a pocket of space. Oh, a nice-looking pass. Oh, yes! What a classy goal! And make no mistake, there aren't many in the game who would have the confidence to even try it. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. in this match now 3-1 it is substitution for Manchester United coming off the pitch number 8 Juan Mata to be replaced by 
Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Pivotal moment defensively. Well read to put an end to that attack. And the emphasis is on creativity. And he's in. And the keeper did more than enough. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Taken short. And what a close shave it was. Well, as we approach full time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. He's in with a chance. And the keeper more than alive to it. Well, he's tried to be clever, but he just didn't get enough on it. That's a comfortable save. Bruno Fernandes. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Did well to win the ball back. How about the cross? Well, on the final analysis, his timing just wasn't there. Well, it's always difficult to hit those perfectly, and unfortunately for him, he got that all wrong. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Alex Tellez has it. And he was in the right place to intercept. Bisuma. Breaking at pace. Chance to finish. And the danger is still there. Surely might still be able to do a bit of damage. Oh, he's given it away inexplicably. And it's come off the keeper. Threat over for now, it seems. Dunk. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. And flag raised, offside. Well, that was always going to be offside. He just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. He's in behind. Well, not the best clearance. Rashford. Now Lingard. Can he finish? And they've bought themselves a bit of time. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of their performance, all told? Yes, Derek, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park for the most part. And going forward, there were some really nice, incisive plays as well. Good result for them. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.